Special thanks to Thingy, Lemon314, Lord Entropy, Avali Long, JL, Laszlo Panaflex, Nubix Cube, Val Sharan, A, Bender Waffles Feek, Metric Conversion, Tastari, Ministry of On We Control, Miku Zeech, and Grizzly Old B for sponsoring the creation of these videos. Go to David X Newton on Patreon to join the ASCII Brigade. We are about to experience a Royal Rear Ripper by Finisher with two ends, and it's telling me to leave, so I might just do that. You fucker. <laughs> oh. Um, should I... Should I continue this? Am I going to be stuck with a Cyber Demon in the middle of the map? Well, yeah, we, we, we'll go with it. Uh, there's a Spectre up ahead. Barely see. Now, uh, this is Finisher's first map in more than 25 years, and it's always fantastic to see people coming back to Doom and discovering what you can do with it now. And uh, the idea of this map, it's quite long, as you can see. We've got 506 monsters, one of which is a Cyber Demon. And the idea is that you can take any order of routes. And, uh... Each route has visual cues that clue you in as to what kind of route it's going to be. I'm, I think that I'm going to go up the wall tastefully made out of my crushed and pressed relatives. Because it seemed to have the uh, most uh, Doom 1 vanilla monsters. <laughs> All right, so we've um, escalated quite quickly. Can I jump over? No, I can't. Wow, okay. Really going for the uh, Revenants and Banky buses quite early on. Nice use of lighting, it's really stark and uh, contrasting. Of oh, very dark blacks and uh, bright spots. All right, we are just finishing off the imps now. Well, who opened that? Oh, it's just more imps. Yellow keys there are. Ah. Well, you know what I'm going to say. It can be confusing to use the uh, lit switches as the uh, non-activated ones. Oh. Sorry, I was uh, examining this little crucifix. Stay out here for a while. Well, that was a very enduring spider. Now, am I meant? Am I meant to be able to duck? I'm not really quite sure. I never read these readbees uh, quite closely enough. I appreciate the uh, ammunition, but not so much uh, everything else in this room. <laughs> Worth a try. Scenery is really interesting. Hello, Cyber Demon. Oh, you seem to be stuck there. Is this uh, where the Cyber Demon from the start went, do you think? Or was this going to be a... Uh, there no matter what, and the Cyber Demon is uh, gradually stalking up behind me. The uh, lovely rendered toilet roll.
That's a nice little uh, secret that's uh, unlike anything I've seen. <laughs> All right. Yeah, having uh, the lit switches as the uh, inactive one seems to be a theme of this one. Ooh. Invulnerability. And a megasphere. Can't get to either of them. And uh, I'm stuck on this uh, batch of carpet samples. This is most peculiar. Unfortunate ammo situation there. Right. Oh, was that all? I thought I had a bit more ammunition than that. Oh well. So this Cacodemon is uh, too wide to be able to do anything. He's stuck in the geometry. Uh, so why am I shooting him? I need to just punch him. Right. Uh, what else could I do? Oh, this is bad. I'm not going to get out of here unscathed. Any more rockets? Can't remember what was behind this uh, numbered door there. Interesting use of those skull switch textures. Nope, that's nothing. Okay. So does that uh, give me the soul sphere for that? I may have stepped into the wrong door. Nevertheless, survived multiple seconds. Uh, which one was I going for? Was it this one? Right. Got the armor. Great. Um... I suppose let's try this one. If I can just keep moving... Oh! Uh, I got quite close there. What about this? Oh, cacodemons, okay. I have definitely scuppered myself by uh, having so little health left over. I should have possibly uh, put together that the... Imp door is going to lead to the imps, and uh, a very similar kind of theme for all the others. <laughs> Went at the wrong one again. Okay, let's, let's, let's do this uh, imps one, because I will get a soul sphere after that. Uh, it's not going well, is it? That was one of the less promising efforts. Oops. How am I still alive? Completely undeserved. Oh. One stray imp could have made all the difference. Of course, this will take care of most of the monster kind. All right, get me that soul sphere, please.
Um, where is it? There it is. Right. Invulnerability or Megasphere? What do we think? So that was all the Revenants. Well, and the BFG. Which... Who opened that? <laughs> Alright. Oh, yeah. Hold on a second. There's more to explore here. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Something about this uh, kind of matches. Oh, well, that's interesting. The little arrow there. Is it pointing me towards some sort of secret? There's a megasphere there. I don't see anything. Hmm. Interesting scenery outside. If I could get to that, that'd be nice. The uh, sector work in this map is wonderfully complicated without being overwrought, if you see what I mean. There's a lot of layers. Just like here, where oh, I didn't even notice those details. Where you've got the pillars here, and then you've got the walls heading into the lost souls screaming faces. Uh, very aesthetically pleasing in hell. Uh, there's there's a lot of um, I don't know if variety is the right word, but there's a lot of detail without having to do a lot of sector detailing. Right, I've talked enough. Let's go to. I think the invulnerability would be really good to have against the revenants, but uh, I'm not sure if I can survive the cacodemons, but we'll try. Minor bruise to the face. But apart from that, I'm surprised by uh, how well I survived that. Right, just the Hell Knights to clean up. And then we'll have invulnerability for our encounter with the uh, Revenant Horde. And of course, this is all just one of the available routes. <clears throat> uh, only found one secret so far. There appear to be quite a few on this map. All right, the last of you. And you. Absolutely no problem. It's even a generously placed rocket launcher. So that gave me a Megasphere. But uh, did it give me any progress in the map? Oh, it says there, here. Um, oh, it's backwards. Four... Tra four trail? On the map. Have I forgotten how to read? Sla... Sla... Slayert. What did that do? Right, I still can't read that, but uh, we're going to press on. Oops, uh, might have been a bad idea to keep the rocket launcher, right? Eh? 
Oh, I didn't realize I didn't have the chain gun yet. All right. Well, that's a cache of health uh, left for later. Was I meant to get anything out of that room? <laughs> Don't do that. Maybe I should be looking for a door surrounded by red pillars. Oh, four trials! Sorry. <laughs> well, uh, you've made me look slightly stupid. Let's continue. Ah, yeah, the red, uh, the red pillars! That's a nice way of uh, indicating what a switch does that I completely failed to pick up on. Oh, what's in there? Well, there's a rocket launcher. Is that somewhere I can get to just now? Seems to be a fall of debris there. I'll have to go round. Uh-oh. Oh, don't set me on fire from there. I was luckily uh, stuffed right up against the uh, scenery, which means the explosion damage can't do anything to me. I'm not going out there. <laughs> Uh, I can't BFG them. I have to just make a run for it. Oh! Ah! Once again, the majority of my damage is self-inflicted. Quite a lot of you. It's an interesting uh, place to fight an archfile because as long as you're on the other side of the fountain, you're safe, but uh, you can just walk over it. Right. Let's uh, try and rise above the fray. Can I open this again? I cannot. And furthermore, I'll be absolutely chomped. <laughs> uh, I think this is more of a rocket scenario, isn't it? Did I just hit myself in the face with a rocket? there. Uh, oh, that opens the door, does it? All right. Uh, still no key. I'm looking for a key. Oh, there's one. So I can go back up that way. Okay. Oh, no. 
Oh, there are quite a lot of you. How am I supposed to get through this? Well, if it's got to be attrition. That one back. Oh, forgot where the door was. Oh, how irritating. I kind of want to lure them over here, don't I? And then I'll have a better angle. Oh, unfortunately, so will they. Got to be here all week. Right, come come back over here. Because that was looking quite good. And stop bloody laughing. All right, that's one. That's two or three. Just two. Okay. Still got 223 monsters to go, but we have a yellow key for it. And we're going back to our uh, hub space. Well, we're a bit better armed for this uh, encounter now. I forgot about you. Hmm. I wonder if I should have wasted those. Oh no, I can't go this way. Got to have the yellow and the blue keys first. Well, something's happening over there that I can't see. Well, let's head into this dark space. Really nice detail with the little bootcase altar. Quite a nice, uh... Multitasking bit of furniture. Available now from Wayfair. Um, this is going to cause bad things to happen. I warned you. No coming up here, no stage diving. Oh, I still don't have any... Oh, they're all down there, the rockets. I'm going to have to come off and beat my way into the crowd. Right, this is a, a nice slaughter that I can stay above. Got it. Oh, okay. Oh, 
I've got two of them. All right. Yeah, you see, it looks like that switch has already been pressed. And it did... <laughs> You've used two different ones! Oh, dear. Still. I really love the detail in this map. Just how the lighting's used and uh, how... He's watching you and... Oh, so I can still open the door behind that. But where... Am I going? I switched that one. I, I switched that one even though it doesn't look like I did. What am I missing? Can't open that. Ah! Bit secret looking, that. Okay, we have got the... Oh no, we've got the red one. We need the blue one. Where's the red door? Was there a place, was there a place I didn't go here? It's an interesting uh, way of showing there's something behind there. The seep from underneath. Right, where am I going? There's uh, a red door somewhere. Was it around here? I don't see one. And I haven't been able to get up there yet. What's around the other side of this? Oh. Interestingly, uh, decayed balcony there. This secret was still really nasty. Uh, okay, obviously that needs a blue key. All right, let's have another look around here. Oh, switch. Yeah, this was the way. Oh, there's something in the, the something in the corner. Very nice. And you remembered to put a line action on that line so that I can get out. Okay. Now this is a GZ doomism that uh, bullets can go through the scenery but the projectiles can't, which makes it a bit easier than uh, vanilla or uh, limit removing. I think this is intended to be played on limit removing. That's a useful little limp pounder. Standing in some acidic looking stuff. Don't quite know how to make uh, fluids meld into each other in Doom convincingly. <clears throat> Maybe it's a bit of a lost cause. You don't, you don't need to make it look convincing. You need to make it look like Doom. No. All right.
Oh, there it is. <sighs> I think you felt my eye roll through the screen there. Thank you. Oh, no. Right, that worked out very well. We are just 118 enemies short of uh, beating this map. And these blue banners and torches mean that I'm on the blue route. Or the route to the blue key. Of course, I'm on the blue route by definition. Oh, there's one. Thanks, mate. Something's eating something. Oh yeah, of course this place is absolutely stuffed with monsters now. That's good not having the player go back through a dead area. Oh, the dead area is going to be me. Come on, come on, come on. I didn't get this done. Yeah, this is what I was intending to do. Oops. All right. Oh, can I get through here? I can. <clears throat> Well, that's very impolite. Pretty much an anti-secret. All right. Having to go a bit back through uh, dead areas here. But uh, it's very possible I missed a teleport. I've uh, done that more than once before. I go through here? Yes, I very much did. Let's have a look at this last route. Where are you going? All right. Oops. See you soon. Um. I can just BFG the Spider Mastermind right away. And that might be what I have to do. You gave me exactly enough cells for one shot. There you go. Ow! I'd have to come at this with a bit of a plan. And I'm not good at planning while being uh, shot at from multiple sides. There's a switch there and a switch slightly further back. Uh, oh, and there's a uh, Soul Street as well. That's rather good. Right. Kind of forgot about the switches. That was uh, really part of the plan. All right, the uh, infighting party's begun. <laughs> I 
<laughs> this is like one of those big uh, Roman legion fights from Asterix, where they're all just going everywhere. Demons running after these revenants, trying to bite its legs off, grab a bone. Okay, we've uh, we've got momentum there. Right, bit calmer. That's one switch. Might have some difficulty reaching the others. What? So only three more. One of them's that uh, cyber demon. One of them's that imp. And I think I can cope with the other one being an archvile as long as I'm quick. That's all of them. Well, those just raising that little platform there. That was it! Royal Rear Ripper, what a map! That was an incredibly detailed uh, thing to do for 25 years away from Doom. Uh, just out of interest, if I ID, DQD and ID clip this, and uh, type that a bit better. That's where he goes! So, uh, by not looking behind you from the chainsaw, you get a bit of an easier time in the last arena. But I didn't, and I soldiered through it anyway, and came out just about alive. What a nice map. Thanks once more to everyone listed here for sponsoring my videos. If you'd like to join the Discord or have some ideas for future games to cover, please look at David X Newton on Patreon.